Hey guys, James Wilson Taylor here for Rock Sam. We are backstage at Download Festival's pilot event. Look who's joined me from Trash Boat. Toby's with me now. How are you, man? <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 way, the way you put it when we were just talking is is the way I'm going to describe it. I am I am two minutes to set, and yeah. I and I've been two minutes to set for ever since we found out that this is going ahead. Because yeah. when they announced there was going to be like another lockdown or they were going to not lift the lockdown restrictions, my heart just dropped because oh, I course. was like, they're going to cancel the download pilot. Uh, but it's still going ahead and I, I feel like I'm ready to go. I'm about to step on stage. I've just got I've got 18 months worth of energy just about to explode. Very, very cool. It's Not insane. my words, by the way, Ben Barlow's. I'll take ben that. Barlow, just give credit to the metaphor where it's due credit, right credit there. To the Barlow. Um, I mean, that is kind of the thing, isn't it? Obviously, you're on stage a little bit later on today, but mm -hmm. like, how has the prep been? Did it take a minute to kind of, some people have been like, oh, had to blow off the cobwebs a little bit. Were you guys kind of straight back in or how did it work? Straight back in. I was terrified. I really was because right. I've, I've been just, work like I've got a job. No, of course. I've got a full-time job um, in, in the lockdown period. And, uh, uh, I really thought there would be a lot of ring rust. I thought I was going to sound terrible the first time I, I picked up Mike. But we did like a little live session recording last weekend. Nice. Um, and I said, like, you know, not to, but I've, I've, I've slipped back into it. I feel, very I'm good. I'm feeling strong. Positive. I'm feeling very, very strong. Feeling strong and ready. Ready Fe for this Feeling one. blessed vocally and spiritually, just fucking ready to go, mate. <laughs> well, it's nice to have some new music to kind of go alongside. Obviously, people heard a couple of singles, but the album has been announced now. We know it is coming. Tell me a little bit then about actually putting this together. Was a lot of this, I guess, written in lockdown as well as yeah. recorded? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of it was written in the studio. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, we... I mean, it was a mess, but that's not a derogatory statement. Sure. So, like, it was just a chaotic writing process because we were working with a producer who's just mental. His name's Jason Perry. Ab's just the best fucking guy to have to write your album. He's fucking wicked. Um, but, yeah, we started writing it before uh, lockdown, and then lockdown hit, and we obviously had to switch up our game. But yeah. it was right about that time that we started working with Jason, and we wrote the lion's share of it over Zoom. Right. Like in our own houses, which is just bonkers. The modern world, man. Yeah. And then we had, before we went to the studio, we had maybe 70% of an album. Right. And we had two weeks in a studio to do it because that was the only studio that would take us because it was like full lockdown. Yeah. Um, and in that two weeks, we wrote four songs and recorded the rest, which if you don't know much about writing and recording, if, you, if we had... 12 completed songs two weeks is not a lot of time yeah to track true it all. very true and we got a lot of, we, we had two separate individual studios within the one studio so like me Oakley and Jason would be working on some stuff and then Dan Ryan and James would be working on guitar tracks so we were getting like double the work rate um, and it, yeah it was just mad it was a, it was a a writing style that we'd never ever done before like that a couple of the songs like don't you feel amazing he's so good um, there's an acoustic song on there and there's one other song on the album that were just written in like a day each Wow, and they were like proper like sort of off the top just like if it sounds good We're just gonna put it down I'm just gonna write the lyrics in a couple of hours and we're just gonna oasis Nirvana it You know, what I mean, yeah. it's like just just feel it and then like two of them ended up being the lead singles amazing so something was working for us yeah it's lovely when it works out like that and yeah, definitely yeah. when you get to adapt to a new working process like that too it's nice to see that you actually were able to get comfortable with it despite the challenges we've all been facing totally, uh, totally. and I want to mention with the album as well I always ask people about album titles I know it's a generic question but I really am interested and that is a big bold statement don't you feel amazing particularly after this last year of hell yeah, we've all yeah, been yeah. through uh, talk to me a little bit about I mean obviously the tracks out there but why do you think that sums up well, that, the that, wider record that's it isn't it like and this, this is the thing like obviously the marketing camp the album campaign itself is like we're saying don't you feel amazing and there's loads of people that comment on our stuff just be like no actually <laughs> don't it's meant shit. to be taken entirely literally yeah, guys like, just a thought maybe we're like we released a music video we're like don't you feel amazing and there's just a bunch of people that's like no nah, actually <laughs> um but yeah i mean it mainly comes from just the way that particularly the song don't you feel amazing makes me feel it okay. makes me feel sexy it makes me feel strong it makes me feel industrial it's like a slow motion walking song you know <laughs> that's You're like a very nice you and the fucking yeah, crew yeah, yeah. doves have just flown out behind you <laughs> action sequence here slow-mo action it just makes me feel strong and like that that's just what i want to i want to impart that on people because it's been 18 months of a big fat pause button yeah on on life um and on music and i miss that i miss that rawness i, I miss that that energy of live shows i miss the sweat i miss that like euphoric feeling of just going absolutely nuts with your mates so we wanted to write a record and pose the question like don't you feel amazing because it's not really a question no. like the music is 
is telling you that you feel amazing yeah. so it's like we're, po- we're postulating a question but at the same time it's like you feel come on yeah yeah come yeah. on how's you that make this? you feel you feel you feel you're, i know you're feeling this because it's fat that. yeah that's very, Pig in the very gap. cool man it's absolutely fat sounds great live today as well i'm sure I, like I'm, you must be hyped about playing that one in particular I mean, playing anything. Yeah, that I mean, one. playing anything. I'm. I, we don't get to hear it. We get to hear just the in ear mix. Sure. Like, I wish I could step outside and hear it because, like, I think it's going to be fat as hell. Man, it's like some of the really tones are, that we've got for the. Oh, oh. It's very exciting, man. It's exciting to have you guys back. And then big tour plans, I guess, for the rest of the year as well, which big is really, really cool. Have you been thinking? I mean, loads of people who've had their tours planned out have obviously been writing set lists in their mind for over a year. Is that yeah. the case for you guys? You've been figuring it out? Well, we've still got a couple of songs to come, uh, a couple of singles before the actual album is released. So obviously, um, we're probably going to add uh, those into yeah. the, to the set that we've got. I mean, we probably shouldn't say this. We thought up until a few days ago that our set was half hour. And then we were like, yeah, by the way, it's 50 minutes. <laughs> so we were like, that's incredible. Throw a couple of extra songs in there. It's that's great, though, because we like, we get to play more music. Yeah, of course. Um, but yeah, we've got all the new tracks that we've put out so far in that set. They all feel so good to play. I mean, like when we did that studio session, I just went in there. I mean, this is going to sound so fucking arrogant. But I, I went in there and I, I just one taked all of these new songs. Brilliant. And I, that never, ever, ever happened. Right. Because crown shyness don't you feel amazing is just like na, 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 just vocals 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 yeah, screaming yeah. screaming screaming chorus 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 and i was never very good at being consistent with that kind of vocal style but after five or so years you know you kind of adapt but now obviously with this new stuff it's like it's slightly pulled back it's a bit more like grown up yeah. and because i'm just got five or six years behind me of insane stress on my voice doing these like slightly slightly more sort of relaxed vocally songs it's like this is easy yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, just whacking them out like one it by was, one it now. was so good even and it, like even with the bits where it's like if i'm doing some screaming it's not like scream 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 high vocals high vocals scream 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 it's like i get breaks and i can i can pace myself a lot more and it feels just a lot more natural and strong Man, it feels good. amazing. Feels That's amazing. It feels amazing. Marketing. Guys. Uh, really good to see you, man. Looking forward to the set this afternoon. Enjoy it. Drink it in. We'll see you on tour later in the year. Absolutely. All right? Yeah. Uh, the tour is in October, uh, and the plug, album plug, comes plug. out on August the thirteenth. Two more singles to come. But yeah, don't you feel amazing? Dot com get those tickets in everything's on don't you feel amazing.com that's it i like that you had that memorized and ready to go not many do but you're a pro right there there he is toby everybody (laughs) 